Hi everyone, I'm Yue Li. Today I'm going to talk about research and implementation of view synthesis based on DIBR. And the first section is about the problem and the study. As we all know, free view video is an important direction of the stereo video. It provides user with freedom to choose any advantageous position, from which a viewpoint image is constructed to observe the 3D scene. Although the DIBR technology can synthesize virtual viewpoint image quickly, considering the inaccuracy of depth map, the change of occlusion relationship between objects caused by the change of viewpoint and pixel overlap, the virtual viewpoint image synthesized will produce distortion. And after study plenty of related article, I have found out uh, the existing approach and the disadvantage of it. In 3D video, uh, free, vi uh, free viewpoint video is a very essential development direction. And the traditional DIBR, um, so how it works, um, it just plays um, plenty of video camera at viewpoint. And when we got the photo back, we got the color map and the depth map, we can use that to synthesize new view image. As we all know, it is not possible to place a video camera at each viewpoint. So they must be exist unknown viewpoint to be calculated from the known viewpoint. Thus, the traditional DIBR require numerous equipment such as depth camera and also need effective method for camera calibration. So it depends a lot on the hardware. Uh, in this project, I determined uh, to improve DIPR <coughs> algorithm for view synthesis. Uh, to be specific, I have uh, what I have done is the following four points. And for the fourth point, <coughs> I analyzed the principle and process of 3D warping mapping and proposed an improved 3D image mapping method. Uh, for the second point, I select uh, an adaptive block estimation algorithm for desperate estimation. Select mean filter to smooth initial disparity map. Uh, for, the for the third point, I process the local relevant information contained in DIBR data and use the whole folding method of image research. For the last point, uh, in the aspect of image fusion, an improved scheme is proposed. Next is about performance uh, of the existing approach. Uh, with what, we can uh, with what we can see is the crawl code of 3D Warping method. So um, this is the result. Uh, we can see from the result the problem of cracked and the saw tools exist in this way. And after we will see a video to see it um, more specific. And uh, uh, so the crack is about this this part. And the virtual view image have obvious distort in the area of depth discontinuity, like this part. This part. The whole filling will fill the depth value nearby, so the uh, foreground pixel will appear in the background, and there will be more artifacts, like this part. So next, 
uh, it's a performance of my proposed new approach. And this is a basic code for the back, backward mapping procedure and uh, basic code for the bilinear liter pollution. In order to reduce time assumption, the cracked area can be filled when each pixel mapping is completed. Mean filtering is referred to give a template to the target pixel on the image. The template includes neighboring pixel around it, 8 pixels around the target pixel. At the center constitute a filter template. Uh, remove the target pixel itself and then replace the original pixel value with the average value of all pixels in the tablet. In the previous method, we did not view the hole in the depth map. That is the basic reason for why cracks happened. Afterwards, I add a hole filling procedure to the exist program. So this is the flow chart of the new algorithm for single view citizen. For, so for the first step, we calculate the integral of the image and save the number of all pixel points n. And for multi-level mean filtering, first we use a large initial window to do mean filtering and assign a value to a large area of hole. Next time, the window size will be reduced to half of the original one. And, uh, and then the original integral graph will be used to the filter again. And the smaller hole will be assigned value. So and so on until the window size change to 3 multiplied by 3. At this time, the filtering will be stopped and the final result will be obtained. So this is my output. Uh, we can see a video to see it more specifically. So this is the uh, result of the existing approach. So you can see the cracks and salties and distortion. And this is the output of my approach. Um, uh, although it is not that good, but it is better than the existing approach. So you can see it's not perfect because you can also see some distortion here. It's about the um, it's a, it's about the for, forward to be the backward because of the mean filter. Oh, I'm sorry. No. So we are going to the calculation part. Uh, the first thing is what I have done in the aspect aspect of subjective quality or objective evaluation standard, there are obvious improvements, uh, as you can see in the video, which uh, achieve the purpose of improving the quality of virtual viewpoint image. <clears throat> Although achievement has been made in this project, there are still many unsolved programs due to the limitation of time, energy, and self-ability, <clears throat> which need to be further studied, including filling method of tiny hole, the synthesis of multi-view image, and other more accurate synthesis method. Thank you for listening. Oh, I'm sorry to correct it for this way. For the my approach video, you can see this is not uh, because of the mean filter. It's, a, 
is a because of the uh, feel, uh, whole feeling. Sorry to correct that.